All right, this is how you brace up. If you're having trouble on bottom, doing all the rolls and all that stuff, this is what you do in college, you know, all the high levels. First of all, when you line up, you want to make sure your back is kind of hunched like this, not slumped. Because here, the guy can sink in a tight waist on you. Up here, when the guy gets this tight waist in, put it in. Feel it's hard to kind of slip off. If I was hunched, see, he's got me. But I'm going to get an advantage off the whistle. Dig my toes in. All the weight is basically on both of these knees. Now, if he lines up on the left side, I know he's going to stay there and put pressure. I want to put all the weight of my body over this right heel. I'm going to turn my toes just like this. Windshield wiper him in. I'm going to lean my whole body over here. I'm going to tuck my chin over my shoulder, and I'm just going to brace up. Wide feet, walk your hands back, head up. I see a lot of guys get in this position and they can't get up. Put pressure on me. They get a brace up and they can't get, they can't get to the brace. Why? Because their feet aren't wide enough, they're not out, and their hands aren't back far enough. Here I'm pretty much standing up. The guy goes, let, if he lets go, he tries to cradle you. Look where I am, my head's up, I can stand right up. Cut out. The guy rides you loosely, he goes to follow your hips, hand control. One side, okay? Post it, and you clear out. So, just do an angle, I'm gonna start like this. Weight on my knees, if there's weight on my hands, he can break me down. If the weight's back on my feet, it's like he's trying to break me down on my stance. I'm gonna have my stance the whole time. So he lines up, I'm gonna brace away from his tight waist. So if he's on the left side, I'm gonna brace that way. Against his tight waist, right here. So I am, stand right up. Other side. If he's on this side, I'm gonna have to brace this side, which means I'm gonna lean my feet in this way. I'm gonna tuck my head over this way. I'm gonna walk my hands back and get my feet wide up like this. There's not too many things a guy can do besides cradle you or drop down to a single. If he drops down to a single, good, he's stalling, kick away. First time we'll get caution, second time we'll get stalling, third time you get a point. So I'll have to let you go. So he gets on top, be ready, hunch your back. Brace away from wherever his tight waist is, walk your hands in, and walk your feet wide. So hands in, feet wide, look at me. If you ride your hips, you're out. Right here. 